pressed the wrong button on the camera then. <laughs> Just flashed in my eyes. Hi everyone, Simon here again. Whoa, God, that's got a bright flash. This is one of these um, uh, random videos that I occasionally do. Uh, I've just had a, a comment from one of you lovely subscribers and it just triggered a memory in my head and it just gave me an idea. I mentioned before I didn't really want to go onto the Patea bar scene and all that but slightly off track from that um, I'm going to do a new series. Uh, don't play games with bar girls and this is part one and this is your fault digital nomad investor is um his youtube name <laughs> he just gave me a great comment um and an idea so what's this all about so this guy i'm going to take uh, i'm going to assume he's a, a younger gentleman and uh he was based in i think he said chiang mai um or north thailand somewhere for a few years and he went down to one of the resorts, probably Patea, for a weekend getaway with a friend of his. Um, now they both spoke decent Thai, uh, a decent amount of Thai by the sounds of it. And as a joke, they thought, let's go into this beer bar. And they agreed um, the day before, is it uh, as a joke, agreed to say, we just got into Thailand, oh, agreed to to say they just got into Thailand the day before never been to Thailand before and acted completely clueless uh, we didn't they didn't speak any Thai to the girls at first when they went into the bar uh, he suddenly had six or more girls around the pair of them like honeys to the uh, bees to the honey um, and this goes on to that vlog I did about the scoring system of the girls from 1 to 10. And uh, so they sat there and had some drinks for about 20 minutes, chatting away to the girls. So the girls thought, oh, this is a number one or a number two. Yeah, depending on his uh, dress sense, I don't know how he was dressed, he didn't mention it. But all the girls could be a number one or two. This, this is prime target, young men first time to Thailand uh, at which point the digital nomad investor I'm gonna call you Fred and your friend um, nodded to each other and started speaking in his words 100% Thai um, and then he goes on to say you would have thought we pulled out guns and started firing at them the girl scattered w away from us immediately. The bartender even walked away. They couldn't run fast enough away. Now, <laughs> I've seen this happen a few times when I was uh, a man bar manager. And it's playing games with the girls. Now, I've also seen this happen and it go wrong. So this is a warning to you, okay? I have seen the girls turn on, uh, it was about four lads, and I think it was in Soy 8 in Patea. They, they don't want to lose face. When this happens, they don't want to lose face, that's why they scatter. Um, but these, this was late at night, maybe one in the morning, everyone was quite drunk. Four or five guys did this, and the girls turned, and they were throwing bottles at the guy and they just the guys ran the girls went ballistic and this was because of playing this game on the girls so just think of that before you do these because you can get yourself into a lot of strife um and this I've, there's a couple of other things i've seen along this line so I'm going to do another vlog because that's another funny one. But Digital Nomad Investor, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for the story. You've had quite a few years in Thailand. You've got some more stories like this. Put them over. I'd love to do some vlogs on it. It's refreshing and it's, it's quite funny. But just be careful because these girls, you know, they're working. They're trying to make some money. You pull a stunt on them. 
there's that 50-50 chance that they're going to go the wrong way. Um, God help you if you do it to some lady boys in the bars. Oh, ho, ho, ho. don't do that. No. There's another vlog. Oh. There's not enough hours in the days to these vlogs. <laughs> yeah, so there we go. We'll, we'll do a little mini series on uh, on playing games on bar girls. There you go. See you soon. Bye-bye.